Hello, my beautiful YouTuber ladies and gems. This is the look that I am going for today. I really enjoy doing this look. Um, I like it a lot, you guys. Like, I really, really like it a whole lot. Um, it is basically just a really subtle eyeshadow, but I lined my lid with three different um, colored eyeshadows. I used a bronzy brown, a red, and a really dark purple. Lined that top and bottom, and then I went right inside of that with black eyeliner. Go ahead and give you guys a close-up of this look. I really liked doing it a lot. It was supposed to be like a Halloween look, but now that I'm done with it, I really think that I might wear this like out somewhere, not just on Halloween. Um, I will probably do it for Halloween, but to me, it's not dramatic enough just to be like a Halloween look. You could wear it like to a Halloween party or take your kids trick-or-treating, whatever it is that you guys will be doing for this um, holiday. I don't really consider Halloween a holiday, but you know, Whatever you guys are going to be doing, this is a really good look, but it's not a really dramatic look. I will try to upload a more dramatic Halloween look um, before Halloween comes around. So yeah, if you guys want to see how to get this look on your face, then stay tuned. Cream pod. Go into the white color here with a eyeliner brush. Revlon Cream Quad. Go into the white color here with a eyeliner brush. eyeliner brush go into Coco by Bella Pierre Cosmetics mineral shadow pigment whatever you guys want to call it tap it on to the first one third Next, same brush, go into this red shadow, go into the second third Veruca Bella Pierre Cosmetics into the last third Mixture of this purple here and this dark bluish purple. And go over the Veruca. blending brush, any color that is close to your skin color, blend that into the crease, go ahead and deepen that crease color with a color that is two to three shades darker than your skin tone.
small shader brush, go into whatever tone that you are comfortable with for your brow bone highlight. And then with the same brush, go into a shimmery silver color over that brow bone. And you should look like this. That is it for the shadows. Any black eye coal, tight line and waterline, liquid or gel eyeliner in black, and do a winged eyeliner inside of the shadow. I'm going to go do that. I'm going to apply mascara. The mascara I'll be using is my Great Lash in Black is Black. By the way, the eyeliner I'm using is the e.l.f. Liquid Liner in Black. The eye coal that I'm using is NYC in black. And I'm going to apply my, oops, my Everlash lashes in EL138. And those look like this. And I'm going to do the rest of my face and I'll be back. Okay guys, I am back. Um, I've gone ahead and done the rest of my face. Um, I really, really like this look. This graphic eyeliner look. Um, I think I'm going to wear it on a regular basis actually. Well, I shouldn't say like regular basis, but you know, like often. Anywho, just let you know what I do with the rest of my face. Um, my blush is this blush by Aziza. It is in the color Urban. And I used this pinkish one here. It's supposed to be a blusher and a contour, but I'm too dark for this to use it as a contour. So this is just another shade of blush for me. But I used this one. Um, on my lips, I lined them with just a dark black. Dark black, I'm sorry. Not black. Dark brown lip liner um, from NYC. I did the outside of my lips as well as the inner line of my lips with this color. It is Mocha by NYC. And then I did the center of my lips with this really pretty pink color I just got. Um, it is Wet n Wild 525D. Really like pinkish, purplish, fuchsia color. I love, love, love. That's in the center of my lips. And then I glossed the center of my lips with this lip gloss by Aziza. It is a really bright fuchsia. I love it. It doesn't have a name for the color, but it's really pretty. I did that just in the center here. Where I put the fuchsia lipstick. So yeah, this is the finished look. I hope you guys like it. I really, really do. And as always, you guys, peace, love, and I will see you, ladies and gems, in the next video.